watching the Jazzy Mango Red Carpet Lounge. Make sure you sit back and relax, and we got a hot show for you today. So make sure you subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Listen, Chief. You can get at me on Facebook at Double E Chief. You can get at me on Twitter at Chief. You can get at me on Instagram at Double E Chief. You got to come holler at me. I'm here with my girl, Jazzy Mango. We finna get it in. Hey, To the Jazzy Mango Red Carpet Lounge. I'm sitting here chilling with my girl, Chief in the building. What's good? What is good? What is good? How you been? I've been hanging in there. Listen, we've been trying to get to each other for a while yes. now. It's been some deterrences, but we here. We here. We here now. We here. We here. Let me know. So after you know what you get go, went through, mm -hmm. how you feel your music has changed? Oh man, my music have changed a lot. I had time to get back into it and really find the sound again. Mm -hmm. um, it was great. It was wonderful um, to sit back in and and study my music and get to know how my music gonna sound now. Absolutely. Yeah. What kind of sound do you have? Um, I'm very unique when it comes to music. I'm, I'm open. When it comes to music, I just love all music. So I try to find that one beat that fits me. Absolutely. Yeah, so I can get the, the voice of it, to get the tone of it. I'm just a music hall. I just love music. So explain to me, how was you as a child? Was oh. you wild? Were you into books? What really gave you the love of music? Uh, I was born into it. My mm -hmm. mother used to sing, um, so I was just born into it. I just got to love it. Um, when it came to me going out there in the world, I was like, man, I like this. When I first heard rap, you know, heard the instrument of hip-hop and R&B, um, I heard my, at school, I heard them rap, and I said, man, that sound cool, that sound cool. And I just got to love it since then. I just did love it. So, um, what were some of your influences? I'm um, growing up. Tupac was number one. Okay. Tupac was one of my main issues, and another one was Bone Thugs and Harmony. I Ooh, love Bone Thugs. Okay, okay. I was a big fan of Bone Thugs. Gotcha. Um, basically, um, just so many of them. Um, when at first, when I really, really heard the, the tempo of of flowing was uh, Crucial Conflict. I know you ever heard of Crucial Conflict. Mm -hmm. You know, um, just basically them and. And then start going on. We had Master P. And mm -hmm. I mean, it started rising and rising. I just got to love it more and more and more as it changed. So your single that you have out now, uh, walk through your mental when you were producing it. Um, my song, my um single, I know, um, that's coming out very soon. Um, you got the exclusive, y'all. Yeah, it's coming out very <laughs> soon. Um, when I was in, when I'm out, when I got the beat, um, from CSP, um, music group, you know, check them out. Uh, when he gave me to be something to be, I was like, I knew this is my beat right here. Mm -hmm. So I was just, you know, wanted to make a song that, you know, where the ladies and fellas, we could just relax. We could right. just chill. It's a vibe. It's a vibe. Yeah. You know, just chill. You know, that's the can we just chill for a minute. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? For we get, get we're going to get. You know what I'm saying? Get, <laughs> we're going to do so now, how do you get up into the DMV area coming from the dirty south? From South Carolina, stand up, baby. Okay. Um, South Carolina. Um, I just happened to come up here. You know, it was just something a different change for me. You know, something that I had to do. You know, at the time, and it was just it was just a whole different vibe that I had to come up here and learn something. So up here in Virginia, DMV stand up, gotta love you. Um, I learned a lot. Mm -hmm. I learned a lot up here mm. as 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 a different southern way. You okay. know, down south is different than Absolutely. DMV. W walk me through that. What's the difference between the two? Oh, it's South Carolina. You know. That's my that's my that's my town. That's my that's my state. Mm -hmm. It's more relaxed, chill. You know, um, people. You know, they. You know, they say hey to you. You know, <laughs> yes, yes, up here, yes. everybody don't want to say. Everybody up here don't want to speak, but it's all good because I know it's a hustle up here. Right, right. It's more hustling up here. Absolutely. You know, it's so much traffic. Mm. You know, you you stuck in traffic all day <laughs> trying to get to work. Your workplace. You know what I'm so to be twenty minutes gonna take exactly, you an hour and a half. Exactly. So it's a big difference. It's just a hustle up here and down south is, you know, we we more laid back and chill and family, you know, family together. But you know everybody's family together, but it's more laid back. Right. You know. So um how do you feel you are as a performer? Oh man, how I feel. Because you got a lot of energy. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> For me, I have a lot of energy. Um I just love performing. As me being a big woman, they say, all right, you gonna get up there and do nothing. I'm gonna get up there okay. and do it, okay? <laughs> I'm gonna do it, okay? You better believe it. Yes. Um, but I just love performing. I just love the sound of just 
hearing hearing the new music I'm gonna put out there. I just love it. I mm -hmm. love perform. I love getting out there in front of people and acting up and showing <laughs> out. You know. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> so but, what do you feel? Um, your influences, like your music. What do you think it could do for other people's lives? Oh man, I. I want to come in. I know everybody say different. Mm -hmm. Everybody want to be different. Everybody want to do everything the same. But, you know, I just feel like I can bring something to the table. Mm. I want you to give me a chance. Right. Give me a chance to listen to me. Mm. And see how different I might can be. You might feel the vibe. You feel me? Mm -hmm. You got to give, give me a chance. How can I say it? Just give me a chance. Mm -hmm. I think you might like it. You know? I think you might like it. And as a um, as an independent artist, how important is it for you to believe in you? Oh my goodness! You the only one gonna have to believe in yourself. No one else will. Absolutely. No one else in the world gonna believe in you but yourself and the ones who probably love you mm -hmm. and the ones who care about you but might believe in you. But if you don't believe in yourself, what's the use you going out there? Absolutely. You know you have to first of all, you have to you have to love yourself. You know, before anything, mm -hmm. you know, and it's very hard out here because yeah. everybody lose who they are out Absolutely. here and say, man, I got to go out here and do this. No, first get yourself right mm. and then go out there and do that what you're going to do. And what you, when you say get yourself right, like I know it's such a big stigma with mental health in the black community. Mm -hmm. And I feel like in our industry, our mental has to be right mm -hmm. because there's so many demons out here mm -hmm. and so many people just here to, you know, tear us down mm -hmm. so have you ever been in a low point with yourself um trying to do music oh my goodness i have sacrificed i have been in trying to make it so much that i just be broke mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. you know eating a lot of um bread mm -hmm. and, and, and some oodles and noodles mm -hmm. you know you when you trying to just make this music, it's hard. You're going to sacrifice a lot. And it's, it's like it's like you don't have no way else to go. Absolutely. You don't have no way else to go. And you're like, man, why I keep doing this? Mm. Why I keep doing this passion in mine? Because everything's so... Everybody got their hand out. If I want to give this person some new, uh, some situation, like, like you want to help me, my brother or sister, oh, I need this. The next brother and sister going to need this. Everybody got their hand out. And I understand this world is about money. And I understand. But Lord knows, mm. it is a pain and suffering. Yeah. Absolutely. Yes, it is. Absolutely. What sets you aside from any other artists? Um, I'm chief. I'm the meaning of life. I am it. I have... I, I know the pain, I know the suffering, the hurt, I know the happiness, the sadness, the joyful, I know all of it. I am that Indian. I am that chief. Mm. I like that. Oh, yeah. Is that where your name derives from? Ah, yes. My name derived from becoming chief. At, I, I, somebody, we was in school, and um, we were sitting down, I had a bunch of my friends around, and they was like, man... You look like a chief because, you know, your hair is so long and, you know, you just look like an Indian. Mm -hmm. And I said, hmm, that might be a cool name for a mm -hmm. female because nobody else named chief and especially would be a female. So let me just try. And when I did the definition of it, what it mean, I said, I like that because mm -hmm. I like that. I like that definition because I am the one. Absolutely. That's coming. Absolutely. Well, we appreciate you coming here on the Red Carpet Lounge. If you just want to let everybody know where they can find your music, if you got any upcoming shows, let them know. And your spirit has just been amazing. You have been amped and pumped since you got oh, up here. Yeah. I'm telling y'all, oh, yeah. she done got me amped and pumped. You oh, already yeah. know I stay amped, but oh, yeah. Chief, she the real deal. Oh, go yeah. check her out. You got to check me out. You got to go check me out on Facebook at WE Chief. You got to check me out at Twitter at Chief. You got to check me on Instagram at WE Chief. You know, you get at me, holler at me, tell me what you think, tell me your comments, you know, and we can we can talk. We can see what's good. If you like what you hear, let me get your opinion on it. Mm -hmm. You know, I like to hear what everybody out there thinking about the music or think about my music. We're going to see how different I am. I'm going to show you how Chief is. I'm going to show you what the meaning of Chief is. Yes, y'all. And make sure you definitely stay tuning into the Jazzy Mango Red Carpet Lounge. Also, follow me on Love Hurts on the Silk White YouTube channel. I said Love Hurts. I mean, Love Hurts. She giving me her accent. <laughs>